Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will see how to download an Excel file by using Spring Boot. First, let's create a simple Spring Boot project using a Spring Initializer. Just add two dependencies like Web and DevTools. Now click on Generate. Project generated successfully. Let's import this project into IDE. Project imported successfully. Let's run this project. Server is started and running on 8080 port. Let's open this project entry point, I mean main class. Here, let's create a simple get endpoint. So first, annotate this class itself as rest controller. Just added one simple method and annotate that method as get mapping. Server restarted. See, it is working. Now let's implement download Excel related code. Open POMXML file. Here we have to add one more dependency and that dependency is commons.io. So let's search for commons.io maven dependency. Here is the dependency. Let's copy. Dependency downloaded successfully. Here you can see I opened Microsoft Excel, add a simple hello world message. Let's save this file inside the project resources folder. Here you can see book1.xls file is available now. Let's add the required changes so we can download this Excel by using the API endpoint. Here first change the return type from simple string to response entity and just add question mark so it will accept everything. But in this case the return type will be byte array. Change the method name. Add download in the cat mapping. Let's create a variable for the file name and assign the Excel file name like book1.xls. If we have so many Excel files, then even we can read the file name from the path variable or request param. So the file name is correct. Let's create an input stream object and read the Excel file by using get resource as a stream method of input stream class. Now, instead of hello world, let's return this input stream, but not directly. We have to wrap this object. So, return response entity, then call OK method, then header method. Here, add response header type, which is content disposition. Another parameter will be file name along with attachment. Then, call content type method. Here we have to mention what type of response this endpoint is producing. So here that is application VND MS Excel. So this is pretty much standard code. Now call body method and just wrap input stream object by using IO utils two byte array method. And this can throw some exception. So let's handle. And here in catch block, instead of stack trace, let's do a proper return. I hope this code you can understand easily. Don't worry, it is pretty much simple and straightforward code. Server is already running. Let's try to download and we'll see it's working or not. See, it's giving error because we have added a new dependency. So the server needs to restart. But here you can see the error, which is no class definition found error. Just pause the video for one minute and try to understand why this error is coming. And if you understood, then add a comment like what is the reason. Okay, it's up to you. Okay, now let's restart the server. Server restarted. Let's try again and see it's working. Let's close the tab and reopen it in another tab. See, it's working without any issue. The Excel file is downloading properly. Let's open this. See, here you can see even the text hello world also is there. That means it's the same file. I'll add this code in the description so you can use it directly from there. I hope you learned something from this video. Please like, share, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching.